And all three of those artists had one thing in common. Their music was played on jukeboxes. For those of you under 30, those are the machines that played records in your grandparents' days. Tonight, we're going back 25 years to show you a store that restored jukeboxes in tonight's Thursday Throwback. It's a challenge to take something that has been totally put out to pasture and uh, make it work. The 40s boxes, they go as high as $50,000, $60,000. Uh, your 50s boxes, they go up to uh, five, six, eight thousand. 8000 some of them to 10000 just depending on what you want. These are my babies. They all have names. Uh, you don't buy a jukebox here. You adopt it. I keep visitation rights. Diana is all original. Um, the only thing that they've done to her that is not original is the grill, but they kept the grill pattern. What they messed up on was they put the W on the wrong side. She's in 1959. It's got to work. If it doesn't work, uh, it's not worth anything. Mm -hmm. 